Hello everyone, my name is Kiva and I teach people how to achieve the luxe look for less. In today's video, we're talking about my top 10 favorite IKEA items under $10. We did this before with $20, but we're going in with an even tighter budget and I have some great things to share with you today. Before we get into today's video though, please don't forget to subscribe, like this video and check me out on Instagram, but let's get into today's video. You guys, I'm so excited about today's video because these are all products that I use in my own home all the time and things I use in my client homes all the time. And it's all about the Lux look for less. Everything is high quality and it's going to make your kitchen and living room and bedroom look super sophisticated. So let's jump right in. So first I wanna start with these glass containers. I don't know about you guys, but I've been so sucked in to like organizing TikTok. I'll put up one of the videos here on the screen, but people love to make their fridges look more aesthetically pleasing because if your fridge looks good, you're more inclined to actually eat in the house and not end up at Outback Steakhouse on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So I absolutely love these storage containers. Um, they have so many different variations of this at Ikea. This is a glass one with just like a rubber top. They also have one with a bamboo top, but this is my favorite one. Um, the top comes off super easily. Both portions are dishwasher safe. I use them for my half and half, my heavy cream, my almond milk, whatever it is that I buy from the store because it actually just takes up less space in the fridge. So it isn't just about aesthetics. It's also about actually being able to see the things that you have. And I just use my Cricut or an Expo marker to write the expiration dates on them and you are good to go. I absolutely adore these. Next, we have the Stelna glass mug. It is super cute. It doesn't have the traditional handle, which is really nice. So it's very nice and sophisticated. It's actually extremely heat resistant. That, which they, that is what they say online, which makes it super popular, but it also is super nice and sleek. It also takes up less space in your actual cupboard because you're not dealing with the handles, which is really nice. Um, these are only 69 cents, which is incredible. So we actually got four. Now I will say they're very dusty. <laughs> From the store, they're very dusty. Of course, wash everything when you first get it home, but these are so nice and cute and they stack super well. I feel like I buy coffee mugs all the time and they say they stack, but they really don't stack and they all look like this and then one's broken and it's like a whole thing. This, it's really nice and sleek. I can just put it right next to my Nespresso and I'm good to go every morning to make my cup of coffee. Now to make my cup of coffee because no Starbucks this month because you know, we're, we're gonna save our money. Um, and I literally just got a new Nespresso. I like to make my own nice drinks at home. I like to froth my milk and I love to do it with the IKEA milk frother. You guys see me go on and on about this all the time. This is the same one I have had for about six months and I love it. Let's see. Look at that. You can see it. It's a great milk frother. It works super well. You use it for milk. You can use it to make mousse. You can use it to make just about anything. I absolutely love it. And it's super affordable. You just put two AA batteries in there. You can use the IKEA batteries. You can use Energizer. You can use Kirkland. You can use whatever batteries you want. Moral of the story is it holds up super well. You just put it in some water with some soap to wash it and you are good to go. The next items are these pie dishes. So I absolutely love these pie dishes because I, I don't just use them for pie or cake or anything like that. I use them for breakfast. So if I wanna do like a little oatmeal bake, I wanna put some fruit in here. I'm like literally talking as if I have breakfast. I literally never eat breakfast, which is a bad thing. But to motivate myself to eat breakfast, I do have these and they're really great. They are heat resistant. You can put them in the microwave. You can put them in the oven. They're not gonna shatter. I've tried it. Um, my wife makes apple crisp and she puts it in here for me and it's always super good. Um, and I think they're just so, nice and cute and you can actually fit a really healthy portion in here i honestly feel like you could use this as like a side dish um, for like a meal if you need like a little bowl for something this can accommodate that and they're just really nice and sleek and again they stack super well and i know that that's such a trivial thing but maximizing the space in your cupboard especially if you're dealing with a small space is really really important and you can definitely do that with the ikea stuff and i don't know they're just so cute and i just want dishes that look good because a lot of the times i feel like you find dishes and they're ugly but they really work and you've had them forever i.e dollar tree dishes and or you get really expensive ones and they're so expensive like you never want to use them or you have to be so delicate around them here you kind of get the best of both worlds now let's leave the kitchen category for a second to talk about these faux branches. So I'll be honest, I don't often buy faux branches from Ikea because everyone has them. They all look the same. Not to say that they're not good quality, but they're just not the branches that I want until I found these ones. So these ones are super cute. They are the Smica. They are 26 and a half inches, which I think is massive for a faux floral. I believe they were like $6.99 or $3.99. 3.99, thanks babe. They were 3.99 or 2.99? 2.99, they were 2.99. Sorry for that back and forth. Um, 
and they're really nice and long and they they i mean for a faux floral there's there's nothing better when it comes to price and they look so realistic to me they don't have as many grooves as like faux florals have sometimes sometimes people make faux florals and they're like hey i got something green and then i put it on a straw do you like this and you want to buy it for 20 dollars?" and the answer is always no but this this looks very realistic especially for 2.99 thanks again babe um and it's a really nice fall faux floral so you want to have a faux floral but you're like uh I don't, I only want to do the green. I only want to do bright stuff. It's the fall. I don't want to do the orange. I don't want to do the burgundy. I don't want to do the mustard. Well, you can do this. You can have a little bit of brown, really nice and easy. And what I'd probably say is grab this and also grab this, which you can also get from Ikea. This is not under $10, so it's not officially in this video, but I absolutely adore this vase. And again, with any faux florals, it does have the ridges where you can fold it down or you know cut it down to size i'm not going to cut it down but i'll just show you what it looks like in this vase really quickly so nice and cute i'd probably use this in my kitchen or on a sideboard something really simple or just use it as filler in like a an arrangement you're doing if you're spending a lot on the other faux florals save money on these ones next we're talking about pillow covers these are going to count as one but they are from the same collection it is the p pranka collection um and these these look luxe guys this is the epitome of the luxe look for less they are super cute you can see they are velvet but they also have like a shiny portion so it is striped and it just adds some dimension if you don't want just like a basic velvet pillow it goes really well actually with my like restoration hardware pillows that i spent like 200 dollars on a piece these blend in super well so i think that's saying something um and you can't beat the price and what i like to do as you know is i'll grab some of these and i'll get the fajadra pillows which i'm going to talk about shortly put a 26 by 26 in these 20 by 20 pillow covers and have a field day they look so nice and sophisticated i do have to say that i am partial to the gray because this one is definitely a more of a champagne and less of a beige but if you are glam if you have a lighter color palette this could also work super well and i know i'm always talking about pillows but i have to put you on to these new sanella cushion covers so sanella is um, ikea's velvet collection they have curtains they have pillows they have something else as well i can't remember what the something else is but they now have some new colors of the sanella and i'm obsessed with this olive green so they have the olive green in a lumbar size and in a 20 by 20 it looks divine it looks divine it is the olive green of your hopes and dreams and if you are not dreaming about olive green what are you doing here on diy with kb because that's what we dream about here i absolutely love this it is the right it's the sophisticated shade right when it comes to the greens and the green velvets you have like the very glam in your face like off-putting green and then you have this green and this green is only 9.99 and we love that price point they also have this chocolate brown, which I think is kind of sexy. Chocolate brown is a sexy color. It's a really nice way to add some darkness to the space without having to commit to black because black doesn't work with every color palette, but brown is such a nice one. And they have this dark chocolate and then they have like a, um, a caramel maybe no that's that's too liberal maybe a mocha um so they have these two different shades they complement each other really well and this collection with the paprika they're all mixed together now they meld together super well obviously the same sheens so you can use these to really jazz up your living room your sitting room or even your bedroom and again i've got to give a shout out to the fajar dryer this is the next item i love these pillows I have a pillow problem. I'm telling you, the other day, I, my wife and I were going through our bedroom and I had 26 of these pillows in there. For what? For what? But let me just show you how amazing these pillows are. When you open them up, they are fantastic. They expand so much. These are down pillows. So if you don't like down, they also have down alternative. These are definitely better though, but let's see what she's made of. Okay, you can see this is a nice big full pillow. This is a lumbar pillow. That's what you're gonna grab um, your Sanella or your Pipranka, throw it in here and it's gonna look so nice and luxe. You can put this in between two um, square pillows. You can put this on your bed. Now we're going back to kitchen items because we want a luxe looking kitchen, especially since we have these brand new cabinets here. Um, this is just a wine opener, a corkscrew, if you will. Um, this is just good to have on hand if you have guests. We do not drink at all, but when people come over, they're like, how do I open this bottle of wine? And I'm like, I guess just stare at it really hard or sing at a really super high pitch. But we have this from Ikea, it works super well. You can tell we don't use it often because the tag is still on there, but it is there for our guests and people absolutely love it. It gets the job done. Um, and that's really all I have to say about that. 
One of the things I hate most about adulthood is the cost of normal things like aluminum foil and uh, plastic bags, specifically Ziploc bags. So Ikea came up with their own bags and these bags bring me joy. I got to a point where I was just kind of like, I'm just gonna stop cooking food because I can't, I have nowhere to save it. So we have these Istad bags from Ikea. They have so many different sizes. Um, this is a 14 fluid ounce and a 34 fluid ounce in there. And then this one is just the 34 ounces. I don't really know how they like determine the size on these but they work super well they do not break i use them all the time when i'm packing lunch for babe or i have like a baggie full of something i don't know whatever it is they they work super well they are a fraction of the price of normal ziploc bags and i just want you to save money and these will definitely do the trick now this is one of my more recent ikea discoveries this just blows my mind so it's a mixing bowl and you're like keep it it's a bowl it is not just a bowl so one it has this amazing handle right you can you can like pick stuff up which is great um it also has a uh, measurement lines in there so you can know how much stuff you have in your actual bowl but this is the exciting part you can actually lean it and it will stay i'll have to insert some b-roll and it will stay sitting up which is fantastic and you can pour out of this spout could pour this way and it still has like a direct line to wherever you're going that's one of the worst things about cooking you have to get a cup and another cup and a spoon and a wrench and whatever to try to pour something into your cupcake mold when you could just use this bowl and pour it in super easily. It just cuts down on the dishes and it actually makes you want to cook at home, which is something that I want to encourage everyone to do, including myself. The very last item of my 10 IKEA items under $10 is this Vatten Dan's um, paper towel thing. So let me tell you the story of this. We use too many paper towels. We don't want to use as many paper towels. So we use, try to use reusable rags and things like that. But sometimes we need things for like spills or something like that. So we got these and they are very, very durable. I'm gonna take one out to show you. Look at that. This belongs in one of like those Charmin commercials. This is a really high quality paper towel. It soaks up a ton of stuff and there's a hundred in here and this 100 are gonna take us really super far. And we've kind of replaced all of the paper towels we have in our home with this. You just need one to clean something up or dry your hands. For 100 of them, it was $1.49, which I think is a great price because paper towels are super expensive. Every time I go to Costco, I just like wanna faint when I look at the price of the paper towels. I know it's in bulk, I know the cost, whatever. But these are super great. They come in this really retro container but it is a really nice way to take out the paper towel instead of having that uh, roll sitting on your countertop it's just a flat box and you can pull it up like this like you would a tissue and what I like to do is I like to grab it and put it in my drawer and just sit it in there so when I need a paper towel I'll open up a drawer and they're just right there I don't have to stare at them all day and look at how ugly they are okay guys that's it for today's video those were 10 of my favorite IKEA products under $10. I absolutely adore all these products. I use them every day. I use them in my clients' homes and they help my kitchen and my home in general look so much more sophisticated. Plus everything is super good quality and you cannot beat the price. What are your IKEA favorites under $10? Let's chat about it down in the comments. Do you like any of these products? Do you hate any of these products? I want to know. If you liked today's video, please don't forget to subscribe, like this video and check me out on Instagram. And until next time, have a beautiful day.